Today's video is brought to you by Card Kingdom. Uh, let's go ahead and play this. Have Rune Crab trigger first. Obviously, target the opponent. One, two, three. Oh, yes, dude. Double Uro. That feels so good. And now, the clock. Are you looking to get your party together? Well, don't you worry about it because Card Kingdom has your Zendikar Rising singles up for pre-order right now at www.cardkingdom.com. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Historic 101. This week we're playing the Mill. Mill House, whatever you want to call it. M who wants to be a millionaire? Mill, 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 mill. Uh, I've been waiting to play this mostly because we got some sweet new cards thanks to uh, Zendikar Rising. Uh, but the deck does kind of like play a little bit like a, like a control deck, like the last one we built, but we dropped the rogue package. So we're all in on the mill. We're not very aggressive. We actually are the opposite of aggressive. I think the most power we have in this deck is a 1-4. And so, uh, like outside of the sideboard, of course. But yes, so we are all about just milling our opponents out of the game. And the way we are going to try to survive the historic meta is using cards like Confounding Conundrum. Uh, and, and, and like to like pretty much slow down ramp decks and of course maybe the Singleton Ashiox Erasure You may be wondering why that's here. It's to hopefully just eat a Muxus and then be done with it But uh, the key some of the sweet new cards that I had mentioned were like Ruin Crab Which is what we've been needing some kind of Hedron Crab. I mean if this were modern you could have eight crab but uh, you know, maybe they, they should just put Hedron Crab into this format, but yeah. Uh, and then we have Blood Chief's Thirst, uh, which kind of is arguably a, the, a better Fatal Push. It is at sorcery speed, uh, but, it, and, but it does scale up and hit Planeswalkers when you hit the Kicker. And of course, you know, we have the modal double face cards, which by now you all know is amazing. Seagate Restoration, even Agadim's Awakening, as it's a way to pull back a Crab, a Bruvok, and all that stuff. Uh, and then we have the one-hit kill here, or whatever you want to call it, the one-turn kill in Bruvok the Grandiloquent, which you would, shouldn't be surprised by now that it's in a mill deck. But the thing here is it doubles the amount that you mill. So then we cast the new Maddening C Cacophony? C C uh, yeah, the Maddening Caca and uh, Cacophony. C C Cacophony? Cacophony. Okay, anyways, uh, two mana, but for four more mana with a kicker. First off, it's each opponent mills eight cards, right? So it gets around, like, I don't know, if your opponent randomly has Hexproof or something like that. But then if the spell was kicked, instead each opponent mills half their library rounded up. So when you have these two together and you double that, you know what that means. Their whole library, gone. Thrown into the sun, and that is awesome. So without holding up any longer, let's get into the video. It's, it's Cacophony, I think. Maybe. All right, let's take the play. We've got a Rune Crab. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm on board with this. We have Removal, we have Rune Crab. What more could you ask for, right? Well, this is fine. We got a removal. Rune crab. Maddening cacophony. 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 <laughs> yeah, cacophony. 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 There. One of those three. All right. Whatever. I think it's. I think it's actually cacophony. I think that's what I last heard of it. Cause, but but you know what? The other one sounds so much cooler to say. So I'm gonna go with that. Maddening caca. That's right. We're adults. We're making. We're using big words here. This is vocabulary that. May you may not understand for those watching at home, so you know, like you know, feel free to to let me know if you just don't understand the big word I'm using. Oh no! Why are you thought seizing me, dude? Who even plays thought seize? I'm just kidding. Every thought seize is very good, but you know what? Whatever. Ruin crab is better than thought seize. You know what? There goes my my maddening caca. Well, that's unfortunate. No caca for us. Oh, oh, good, 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 good. It's Saltai. Uh, get in there for three. Oh, wait, no, I don't have... Oh, wow. Oh, man. It's a zero power... You know what? Rune Crab should have been a one mana 3-3. Three, three. I, th I think it should have been a one mana 3-3. Three, three. Maybe I'm asking for too much here, but, you know. I think it should be a one mana 3-3. Three, three. Um, well, that's kind of caca. Yeah, right, well, we're gonna just go ahead and play uh, the Seagate Restoration tapped and pass. No need to cast anything right now. I want them to play the Uro, and but I don't think they will, so sure. Let's go ahead and just eat up this uh, Nissa. I mean, would I rather lose to Nissa or Ugin? I'd rather lose to Ugin every time, so. Yeah! So, how, what are the odds that they have something right now? Pretty high, right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. I can't do both in one turn, so I'm just gonna go ahead and play Bruvok. Right, because I can't, I can't play Bruvok crab you know without playing the fourth land so all the same there hey 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 you watch it with that growth spiral that is not cool dude no more growth spiral nonsense 
Uh oh. Am I about to eat an eliminate here? Oh, uh, it's an eliminate. No lemonade? Ah, uh, yeah. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and play this. Have rune crab trigger first. Obviously, target the opponent. One, two, three. Oh, yes, dude. Double uro. That feels so good. And now, the clock. A total. Two creatures attacked. One damage was dealt. Hmm. Uh-oh. That's poo-poo time. Hey, so, like, this is a pretty good magic card. But you know what's great news? Hopefully is great news is that I have a way to kill it and they don't have a follow-up. That's that's kind of where I'm at right now. Can you not uh, play that? Thank you. Oh, just draw a land. Okay, cool. All right. Well, you know what? As, as much as I love me some good milling, I also want to not try not to lose as much. Oh, uh, yeah. Six more things gone. All right. So they're down to 27 cards. They need to chill out here. Hold on, hold on. Opponent's got seven mana. Three, six, seven. This is big old crisis time. I block, I guess. I mean, is there a reason not to block? Do you have, like, disfigure? If you have disfigure, you embarrass me. You got me. You got me good. All right, a big old crisis. You got it. Seems about right. Huh? 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 Yes! Yes, dude! We got it! Taste it! c c, -c, -c combo c, -c combo combo the Maddening Kaka. All right, let's go. Where are we going, Krim? Don't worry. Um, so Maddening Kaka gets there, dude. Oh, Maddening Kaka is so good. Oh, I love it. Uh, Graph Digger's Cage. That's a cool Magic the Gathering card, but how many do I need? I guess a decent amount. They do play Uro. I should semi-respect one of the most broken cards. Uh, all right. So the scabby G's. We have ten cards to take out. It's Merfolk Secret Keeper. I mean, it is an O four, so it does block forever or five ever against Nissa's lands. But the maddening Kaka, you love to see it. Ah, oh, that just makes you so happy. <laughs> I don't even know if I can just keep countering them, right? Like, I need to have a real threat. So I guess Blood Chief's Thirst can go down a f like to three. Uh, cling to dusk. You know what? I'll go down to Graft Digger's Cage. This is, this is interesting. I'm at, I'm at a point where maybe my list has only main deckable cards. I should just play... I don't know, Ashiox Erasure does a good job of stopping some key things. Narset's nice at stopping their ability to draw a bajillion cards. Um, you know, maybe we don't need Grab Digger's Cage. That's for goblins, right? We're, we're fine. If we're worried about Uro, we, we got stuff for Uro, right? How many lands do we have? It's time to start cutting lands. We have 22 lands, including the spell lands. Okay, maybe you can't do that. Um... I don't know what to cut. Oh. <laughs> We're just going to start shaving random things. <laughs> All right. Didn't Say Please has a cool name, so I guess we'll cut Thought Collapse. Ashiox Erasure is fine. I guess the Scabby G's isn't needed. All right. We'll try for this. This seems good. Maybe we don't even need Essence Scatter, actually. There we go. We'll play like one Essence Scatter. Uh, I do not like that we don't have a crab. But we do have some solid three-drop planeswalkers. Let's run it. Seems good. Uh, we'll go and play Agadim's Awakening. Tapped, of course. Wait for them to Thought Seize or whatever. And then we're going to go ahead and use the Bajuka Bog. Eat up one card. I mean, I want to play this island, actually. But, oh. Oh, what's that about? I can mill them eight right now? Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Like, they can't play Uro yet. Right? So we just mill eight. Hope that we get to play, like, they try to play something fancy this turn. We play Ashiok. I'm tapped out. Uro, perfect. Okay, no. I need them to not have untapped blue mana here. Oh, or just, un or mana at all. That's even better. All right, let's do this. And now we go Ashiok. And they called it at Trashiok. You get out of here with that. That's two Uros gone. Permanently. Goodbye, Uro. Didn't even need the BNR. Didn't even need the BNR to get rid of that. All right, you know what? That's that's rude. I wanted that Ashiok, but okay. Blue land? I'm not good enough. I just wasn't good enough. I didn't believe. That was my problem. Uh, all right. Well, going for this. Yup. Target you. Crab goes off. Eat up the yard. I mean, I I do need to find like another blue land. So. However, I don't want to get caught out with having 
this, uh, like, Bazooka Bog, and, like, maybe the opponent plays, like, Nissa, because I need to answer Nissa instantly. Well, that's odd. They took my, uh, my thing. You know what? I, I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play Narset. Let's, let's play the Narset. The Shut off card draw. Open mind. Ooh. Oh, hold on. This is pretty good, right? I mean, Madding Cacophony gets me another eight cards out of their deck. This, I mean, I have an answer to Nissa. You know what? Let's go with the card draw. Let's go with the card draw. So they don't get to draw more. So if they have Growth Spiral, it doesn't work. They have to play Nissa right now. We milled one. I saw one go to the Shadow Realm. Oh, poo poo. Well, that's not good. That's really not good, actually. Thoughtseize. People still play that card? All right, there goes my Ashiok. I did want that. I can just politely have that back. Thank you. Uh, are they are they gonna like remove it or something with eliminate? Because I mean, if they want to do that, they can. Maddening Kaka. All right, nice. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and just jam. Let's play the tutelage, right? Why not? Most likely discarding whatever we draw, though. Do you want to get rid of this Narset? Okay. Hmm. I don't know if. Okay, so we have the combo here, right? Erasure's gone. We're just gonna get rid of Erasure. We're just gonna get rid of Erasure. Alright, we got rid of Nyssa. Play this land. So, how much does this matter, right? Because, like, I, I wanna get rid of the shark, but you know what? The shark, like, Nyssa, Nyssa is just not something I want to have stick around. So, Narset, thank you. Alright, so they have 26 cards left. Let's train harder. Oh, we hit that land. That was really nice. They have four mana here. Okay. So that's exactly what we don't want to see, right? Do they have more sharks to make? Uh, I'm going to hold back on the land. I'm going to hold back on the land. Make them think I might have something. I, I, I do, but it's not what they think it is. It's not a counter spell. All right, go ahead. Please don't be anything too backbreaking for me. I mean, we they do get a land out of this. So by the opponent, all right, nice, and we got there. Uh, this one's not going as well. We need more than a uh, one lander. This I can keep. Yeah, let's let's run that. Let's run that. That seems good. Oh, it's a red deck. We're dead. It's goblins. It's goblins. No, it's a goblin deck. Good game. We just we just politely say thank you for the game. Uh, go to the next one. We cannot beat goblins. Oh, what? Weird. A deck that does nothing but mill can't beat goblins. I know. I know. It's news to all of you, but look. I I, I just I was so blindsided by this. I just couldn't believe it. Uh. I mean, this is not great, but we kind of answered goblin chieftain, right? All right, here's our out, okay? I've got to get rid of Skirk Prospector. Hope that I live long enough to find another answer to Conspicuous Snoop. Oh, they always have another Chieftain. Wow, wow, no attack, like not attacking with the Chieftain? All right, your loss, bud, your loss. Oh, that's, that's just bad news bears. All right, well, we're gonna play Brubach. <laughs> All right, luckily there's a, a land on top here, so any point now if I could just... Oh no, actually the worst part is that everything here is really good at a... I guess block there, block there, take three. All right. Uh... Sure. Look at that. Six to the yard. Six to the yard. What is that? Relic robber? Oh my god, that is so cool. But I don't want you to have that. So let, let's see if I can get around this some way, somehow. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, no! Literally milled him to the Muxus! Oh, no! Right to the Muxus! Okay, well, maybe they don't have a land. Yes! Yes, they do not have a land. Okay, cool. I mean, we, we were still, like, very dead, but cool. <laughs> but we didn't die to Muxus yet. Then we're going to Ashiok's Erasure the Muxus for when they eventually cast it.
No! Wait, that's right. They can go grab whatever. And they also have Goblin Chief and Jeez Louise. All right, you got it, bud. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Oh, we should just... I'm just going to concede. Uh-huh. Very nice, very nice, very nice, very nice. Bunch of goblins. I mean, there are 30 cards, though. Maybe they, they go through their whole library here. All right, all right, bud. You got it. You got all your goblins. <laughs> Let's go to the next one. Very cool. All right. Play some of that, play some of that, and that. A scabby G's. We don't need to ramp uh, or worry about them ramping. Not even really in need of the negate either. Ruvax just <laughs> at this point going to be a good body to block with. So, yeah, sure. Ashiok. Uh, Ashiok shuts off the, the matron. As weird as that sounds. So I might leave one in. Might leave one in. Um, clean to dust gains me life. But it doesn't bring me life. Hmm. All right. Something's got to go. Yeah, you know what? It's got to be clean to dust. All right, I'll take the play. Turns out Goblins is pretty good against us. No Graft Digger's Cage, but we don't necessarily need it right away. We can just try to find it along the way, maybe before. Like, obviously the turn before they go uh, Muxus, but... I'm going to save the Maddening Cacophony or Cacophony. Uh, ooh, nice. Go ahead and just play Ashiok Pass. Cuts them off of any chance of playing Matron and Tutoring or something like that. Sure. They used a fry on it. Odd. Surprised they care that much. Maybe they do have the matron. Oh no, not this crap. Relic robber is great, by the way. I, I love this card. I love this card. I, I think it's so cool. Uh, let's mill you four. Let's go ahead and play it. No, I, I don't think I need to attack. I mean, it can't block. I guess I may as well attack. See if they wanna wanna block it. But I just don't see that happening anytime soon. All right, take two. Um, yeah, I, I gotta get rid of all this stuff. It's it's becoming a problem. And of course, we're gonna sit back and, and, and wait, right? I mean, all right, is it ringleader time? I mean, I need, I wanna get the Scarab God on board. If they don't play anything, that's great, but I just don't see that happening, so. Scabby G's, huh? Yeah, I, I don't think I can I can afford to let them play Muxus this turn. That's fine, I can kill that. Alright, Cranko's a problem. Cranko is very much so a problem. And they literally have Muxus on top. They need to stop finding the Muxus on top. It hurts me emotionally. But I also got lucky and drew an answer, so or a counterspell. Uh, yes. There you go, opponent. Alright. No more Muxus for the opponent, please. Okay, you know what? Never mind, you can have a Muxus if I... If you... But you have to cast it. Because you always have them, right? They're always in hand. Sure, I guess I'll counter that. Why not? Next turn, we deploy the Scabby G's himself. Alright, that's three Muxus down. Three Muxus are now gone. One, two. Wait, what? Or maybe that's two and I'm not able to count. One, two. No, that's only two. It felt like three because I saw one on the top of the deck. Now we play the Scarab God. Scarab God can kind of protect us for a little bit. Really don't want them to draw anything right now. Though. Like, if they could draw a land, not a Matron, not a Muxus. Okay, perfect. That's perfect. Oh. Now that, now I can breathe a sigh, like the best sigh of relief here. I mean, well, I guess I still need a little more than what I've got right now, but. I guess we get Cranko, right? Get a little cranky. Uh, actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna go and grab. Is there something good to get, though? Like, there's nothing here that I really, really want, right? I need them to not have Muxus again. Uh, I guess this gets me a mana. Sure. Nets me a land. Or a, a treasure, sure. 
get a surveil here. Ooh, do I have anything in my graveyard? No, nothing that I can bring back, so throw that away. No, thank you. If I can find Bruvok, we can win in a turn. Oh, perfect. All right, we're good. Now we just nab the Muxus or something like that would be considered annoying, and then just win the game from there. We'll be okay. They're also dead next turn, so I don't know. Whatever these two cards are, they have to be insane, right? That is not fall under the bracket of really, really powerful magic. So, um, yeah, you got it. They're looking to get Muxus. Uh, we get rid of Muxus permanently. Boom. Ashiox Erasure. Get rid of Muxus. So now the only way they can win is just through actually casting all their little goblins. Like, fairly. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Go ahead. Get that on there. So now we have Haste. Eh, uh, does it matter? Not really. Oh, right. It's not a goblin anymore. Womp. Well, either way, I, re I recommend that you do not let me attack. Let's mill some more. All right, there goes eight more cards in the opponent's deck. Oh yeah, you'll love to see that. Yes! Yes! Mill prevails! We get one! We get one! I like it, I like it. Ah. Uh, Ashiok on the draw is a little more punishing and not as forgiving, but we do get to mill eight cards. That's a lot of cards. That's a lot of cards. Holy cow, that's a lot of cards. Um, let's see. Maybe one cacophony can go. Or a cacophony. You know, the correct way to say it. Oh, Sweeper. Perfect. Cool. Uh, that's all I cared about there, that we at least saw Sweeper in the opener. Enters tapped. I mean, I do want some mill cards, but I don't think we're anywhere near that. We're going to win just by trying to, like, stabilize and... I don't know if I want them to have Fry, but I don't know if Fry matters either. Kind of a weird spot. I mean, like, this is the, a way to, like, combo kill the opponent, right? Yeah. It's a way to combo kill the opponent. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just let that... I'm gonna let them keep whatever it is they're doing. No, the Matron. No. No. And another Matron on top must be nice. Um, am I gonna get a better chance than now? I think I can wait a little. <clears throat> I think I can wait a little. They're just going to play that again, though. I need them to commit something better than that. So, actually, I will mill them. Alright, so we hit one, two, three lords, right? Three lords. So that means they have a total of five left. Land being perfectly on top is exactly what I want to see, so... Uh, can't you just draw, like, nothing? That'd be cool. Cranko on top. Delightful. Alright. Huh. Oof. Three, five. Okay, so we gotta find something to kill the... I think that's enough to warrant me to kill their board. Alright. How do I win from here? I need, a, I need to be able to, like, sweep the board again real soon. Oh, no, they have another Muxus. It's not looking good. It's not looking good for the home team. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just play the tap land and... Exile their yard. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do much here. I think this one's... Pretty much a wash. I want them to respect that I could have Ashiok's Erasure. Uh, come on. Come on. I gotta get something good here. You gotta give me something good, deck. Not a land. Please don't let it be a land. Please don't let it be a land. Uh, I don't know how good that is either, actually. Yeah. It, oh, it tap double blue. Auto tapper, no. Auto tapper, no. Auto tapper, no. Oh, that hurts so much. Auto tapper, no, please. All right, maybe we'll just uh, hope that they don't know they have anything to do. I Auto tapper, you. please. Why would you not? Why? Ah, oh, dude, that's too sad, Nick. We'll go to the next game. No turn one crab, but we do have some of the mill package, so I will keep this. Let's see what the opponent's playing. Oh, if they scry, I, I, I like keep to the top. They have a hundred. Oh my gosh. How? How did I get paired against the one person playing the hundred and thirteen? They have a hundred and thirteen cards. They came to play. They already came to play. Oh, pre boarded. <laughs> How do I beat that? <laughs> Can I even beat that? I got a Bruvok. I got a Bruvok. That's it. It's Bruvok plus, uh, 
plus maddening cacophony. Cacophony. Oh, no. Oh, no. Pre-boarded. <laughs> Who thought today was going to be like the day they're going to dunk on the mill player, huh? In historic. There's no mill deck. Everybody's playing goblins. Oh, this hurts me so much. Well, every mill card counts. This will be fun. <laughs> Please. Mercy. <laughs> I've already been tapped, forced into submission. Please don't counter me too. Much. I guess when you have 120 cards, why wouldn't you play counter spells, right? Like, like clearly there is, you can't play around any, like any one thing because the deck has everything. Maybe they assassins trophy this or something like that. I don't know what. What are they? Oh, 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 oh yeah. All right, you know what? I, I haven't seen a creature outside of the risen element. Actually, that's a yeah, that's a creature. Why would I not? Okay, so they're doing some kind of mid range shenanigans. So I, I probably should have kept the blood chief's thirst. But look, I have lands and ruin crab. Lands and ruin crab. What's better than that? Oh, now I feel silly. All right. I deserve it. I deserve it. I deserve it. All right. This is going to be a very hard game to win if I am just trying to mill normally. Uh, I think I've got I've got to just tap out here. At this point, the counterspell plan I just can't imagine working for me. Uh, let's throw that away. Song of Creation, Chemister's Insight, li literally everything is in this deck. Actually, everything is just in this deck. Yup. It's 120 cards. There's no way they have Nissa, right? On five? Okay, Bag of Holding. Alright. Interesting. I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued. Yup. They discarded the Lich Lord. Okay, that's a new card. Uh, that's not a new card, but that's one that I don't normally see. Okay, I have three turns to answer this questing beast. Oh, look. Found it. Oh, boy. Gotta wait another turn. I don't have double black, because I gotta have the kicker. Now, taste, but one that grows no question is, what do I do here? Like, I need Bruvok. I cannot get that many cards if I don't have Bruvok. Oh, please just cast out, like, cast something big this turn so I can counter it. Alright, sweet. They, they, they're... <laughs> is this, like, Saltai, my binder? This is Saltai Binder, right? Like, what do I have? Throw it in there. Huh. Okay. Odds that they have something else? I mean, we, we gotta, we, we're taking a shot here. We need to draw a land. And we need them not to kill Bruvok. It's the only way we could survive this. Because we don't have time. We don't have time. If I just go and play like Blood Chief's thing, okay, whatever, sure. Oh, please, now I need a land. Oh, and I also, it can't be a, a shock land. Because then, or I, a, a bolt land or whatever, one of the, the mythic spell lands. Oh, oh my gosh! Yes! Thank you! Thank you, oh merciful opponent! <laughs> Thank you so much! Not respecting the Bruvok. I love it. Yes. 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 I mean, they won't do it again next game, but... Of course, they could also just counter me. With, like, a mystical dispute, but they, they don't play that, right? Oh, merciful opponent. You don't have it. You don't play it. There's just no way you play it. Bo bolus? Okay. All right. You know what, opponent? Immediately, I love everything you're doing. Just don't counter me. Ah, we did it! 
We milled it! Yes! Yes! Now we get a quick sneak peek on everything they're doing. They're playing like an EDH deck. Oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> and that's what- and what did we learn today, opponent? Respect, Bruvok. Yes! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That was some shenanigans for sure. Um, <laughs> I can't believe we got it. So sick. Uh, <laughs> Merfolk Secret Keeper. Like I, I look at my deck and it just feels saddening to look at it. Like it's like, oh, what am I trying to do? Mill how many cards? It's literally just Bruvok and and Maddening Cacophony. So if if it's not those two, then then we're we're definitely dead. So, uh, Rune Crab. <laughs> I love Rune Crab, but I I just don't see it mattering. You know, like it just doesn't feel like it matters. Uh, Ashiok does. Ashiok does. Um, Cling to Dust. I mean, that's card draw. Sure. Confounding Conundrum. Sure. I guess one of those is fine. So they have Assassin's Trophies, right? So, all right. I can't imagine the opponent. Ignoring Bruvok again, so we want to keep all three copies. Oh, that hand. That hand was all action. I mean, of course, I know, I know. It's only all action because I had nothing. I had no lance. Okay. All right, bag of holding. The swag bag. All right. You got it. Um. I don't know. We go Bruvok first? I think we go Ashiok first, actually. Ashiok first. Oh, well, we'll see if we live. Um, we're gonna shock it in and bluff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna bluff. We have counter magic. We do, they're just not in our hand, but like... Yeah, think about it. You gotta think about it, right, opponent? You gotta think about it, at least. Uh, maybe this alters the decision tree they take, you know? Like... Uh, uh-huh. I, I, I don't have anything. There's, there's nothing I could have that would get you. If I were playing rogues, maybe. Yo, yes! Alright, cool. Ah, I'm so greedy, I wanna play Bruvok! Don't kill it! Don't kill it! Don't kill it, opponent! Don't kill it, it's not worth it. Bruvok's your friend. Bruvok is your friend. Remember that. They don't call him best friend Bruvok for nothing. I mean, they don't call him that at all, but... Sarkhan... No! Let us fight! It's a lot of DiMaggio. <laughs> Uh, well, we're gonna have to go find something to kill that. Uh, it's it's not a land. I know that. I know whatever I'm looking for, it's not a land. Mill their lands though. That's funny. No, I, I won't attack. Actually, I don't think I will. All right, so they play Sarkon. They play five color. It's like five color good stuff, right? Yeah, it's all super friends. All right, so. I don't even know if I want to keep an essence scatter, right? Like we're we're dead here. There's no timeline where we win. Looks like you not when they are able to, to make. They, we are just dead next turn. So. I will call the dragons. All right, Sarkon's not a great one. I mean, turns out this little mana dork here. Because right, like if, if they didn't have that mana dork, we'd be okay right now. But I mean, if my opponent didn't play magic, right? Of course, that argument. But, um. Here. Alright, I'll keep this. Keep it the way it is. Keep it the way it is. Now, can we actually get on board, get things going early? I mean, we had a... We had all of our solid three drops, which was probably our downfall. <laughs> okay, much better. Much better. This I can get behind. Still a 113 cards. I may not even play Bruvok until like I'm close to six mana-ish, if I'm being completely honest. Good, good game. I already got good gamed. Well, I'll give him the heart. I don't. I don't know how we're already dead, but we're dead. Our Dunzo beans. All right, in for zero. What is that scuttle mutt? Uh, okay, interesting. I do not know what the opponent's deck does, so I can tell you that much. Um, what can they play on three? Nothing, right? 
All right, cool. Get in for zero again. How do you feel about that one, opponent? Bet you feel silly about laughing at me now. This 03 crab's gonna mill 104 cards. That's right. All right. I actually can attack now. 19 turns. 19 turn clock. It doesn't obey me. It cooperates with me. What a weird little emote, but whatever. It's you that I want to mill. Hey, wait a minute. You have things to do. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, we get to start scrying this upcoming turn, so... Uh, this will be good. We need to find Maddening Cacophony. Cacophony. The Maddening Caca. Alright, more crads are getting milled. You'll like to see that. Oh man, watch me get punished for them doing like swift response or something like that. Once they find a white source, of course. Okay. 83 cards left in the deck. We'll just, you know what? We'll do this the old school way. The hard way. Oh no, no, wrong one. I guess I'll do things myself. It's me. Ya yeah, boy. <laughs> Come on, you don't have anything. Three, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's right. You have to discard. That's what it is. All right. Taste it. The Maddening Kaka. Oh, yes. It feels good. It feels so good. Oh, so many cards milled. So many cards milled. Yes. Oh, it feels so good. It's okay, opponent. Let it settle. I get it. There you go. There you go. It settled in. Uh, this is a hand that I would love to keep because it has all action, but that's also the issue. It's only action and a tap land. And seeing that the opponent's playing Luris might not be a good idea. So let's go ahead. Bottom the Seagate Restoration. Ruvok, nice. Um, we're gonna go Conundrum. Oh, that's a good draw. As long as we get to keep it, that's a good draw. Oh, the team! I mean, we're gonna get Thought Seize soon, but that's the team! Don't Thought Seize me, dude. Don't Thought Seize me, dude. Don't Thought Seize me. Okay, Young Pyro. Okay, okay. Not getting Thought Seized is cool. Alright. Pass. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me play Ashiok here. Priest of the Forgotten Gods. Oh, yeah, you know, let's get rid of that, too. Um, kind of want to counter whatever they play next, right? Kind of want to counter whatever they play next. Get a little more value off my stuff here. Oh, no, you can have that. That's fine. There's all their lands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, sacrifice that. I'll counter that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. No, not, not, they never milled a Kroxa. Please mill Kroxa? At least, like, three of them or something like that? I'm just gonna go ahead and play this. Ashiok comes down, eats up their yard. There we go. There's a Kroxa gone. That's what you like to see. And with the fact that they mill themselves... This is kind of perfect, right? If they don't thought seize me, I go Bruvok plus Merfolk Secret Keeper. All right. Bruvok Mer uh, Merfolk Secret Keeper time. Come on. I feel like they're about to play something that makes me sad. Two thought seizes milled. How many were, how many other ones? Three, so they have one left in the deck. No, they have one in there. They had it. They had it. No, they had it. Oh, <laughs> Thought Seas Bug! Thought Seas Bug! <laughs> Perfect. How we drew it up, everybody. Everything that I do is calculated, clearly. As you can see, I meant to lose that Bruvok. Can't believe they fell for such an old trick. All right. <laughs> so much better to be lucky than good. Every time. Every step of the way. Uh, what do we want now? Do I not want something here? I mean, actually, Ether Gust. So Ether Gust hits Young Pyro, Dreaded Arcanist, or Dreadhorn Arcanist. You know, yeah, maybe maybe we just keep that a Shave of Bruvok and a Maddening Cacophony. Go a little more controlling. Teferi's Tutelage will casually just mill for me, so 
and it's something that they can't remove. Oh no, feed the swarm exists. Oh, I used to think I was safe. Yeah, I mean, this is just literally graveyard hate the 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 hand. <laughs> literally graveyard hate the hand. I mean, we do need removal because they can't just hit us, right? Ah, very nice. Okay. Um, sure. I could just play the Graft Digger's Cage. That'd require them to blow up two of my cages. Uh, sure. Let's go ahead and mill some more. Welcome to my place. All right, pass. You are free to go about your day now, doing whatever it is, unless it's blowing up my stuff. Don't touch my stuff. All right, deck. I know I got a little lucky last game, so I'm gonna need your help again this game. I need you to come through for me and give me a removal spell. Okay, okay. That's not bad, actually. Holy cow, that's not bad. I guess let's double down on the Graft Digger's Cage. I'm not going to make it easy for them. I want them to go ahead and spend some resources to remove this Ashiok. So if they have a pump spell or something to get rid of this, uh, with, with Lur uh, to kill the Ashiok with Luris, that's fine, right? If they use Claim or whatever, sounds good. Ashiok takes three, goes down to one. Sure. Play the Scabby G's. That's pretty good. Best part is Scarab God gets around the Graft Digger's Cage and all that stuff, so. Feed the Swarm, very nice. A card that this deck desperately needed to deal with, like, Ley Lines and stuff like that. Alright, so they take five. I do get them back at some point, so that's nice. Uh, sure. I get a draw card off that, too, so that's pretty cool. Thank you. I'll go ahead and play that. Play Scarab God again. Just gonna keep playing Scarab God. I do want to exile that uh, whatever from their graveyard. I can't cast the Clings to Dust once they're done, but we are they're under a double cage lock right now, right? Sure. So they, they keep taking five, so they're taking two to kill my Scarab God every time. Because they are gaining the life back. Good news is that, you know, we just... Keep doing it. All right, let's go see if we can draw a card. Uh, not exactly what I wanted, but it's something. And I'm just gonna keep playing Scarab God, I guess, until they kill it. Every turn, every turn, you got it. Soon I will be able to just play my, uh, my... If I get another land here, I can actually counter their removal spell. Ooh. Nope, still want to play Scarab God. Still want to play Scarab God. We're making them use their mana every turn. Because we still have a four-turn clock. They have to exile Scarab God. Uh, what do I do about that? I guess I'll just go ahead and put that back on top of their deck. That's fine. Because we can mill it. Right? They put it on top, that's fine. So we play Tutelage next turn. If I get a Keep Scarab God this turn, that'd be nice. Though we don't actually get to kill it. Alright, pass. Or maybe they want to attack and, like, shot. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! So we got to keep the Scarab God. The God of Scarabs. Okay. Now this is a whole different game. Um, well. I mean... But I mean, you know, like, okay, if I have to. Once again, game plan, protect the Scabby G's until we can go off. If I go off, I mean win. But, I mean, I don't know what else go off would mean. But yeah, like, we need we need Maddening Cacophony and Bruvach. Bruvach. <laughs> yes. Yes, why don't you draw more cards, opponent? Um, you know, I am gonna, I'm gonna let that go. I, I, I maybe shouldn't have, because if they had something, they would have done it now, right? But... I don't see any, like, reason to kill that. All right, and we got there. GG's. Nope, got a mulligan. All right, I'll keep this. 
This seems good. This seems good. Acceptable. Exceptional hand. Uh, let's lead off with Drowned Catacomb. Go into Clearwater Pathway. Oh, no. Oh, whew. I mean, not like this is a better matchup, but it's not Goblins. <laughs> Tell you what, though. I don't think they'll care about con uh, Confounding Conundrum. The str Oh, no, yeah. We're dead. <laughs> we would have to somehow survive, right, long enough to get to six mana to cast Bruvok. Aha! We're okay. Oh no, we're not okay anymore. <laughs> no, not not the Soul Scar Mage. Come on. Oh, dude, no, not that. I actually don't. Uh, okay, well, do we reveal that we're Mill? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, you know, I don't even think I'll reveal that we're Mill. Let's just go to the next game. Let's go to the next one. I feel like I'd be too embarrassed to show our opponent. Yeah, I, I'm a mill deck, by the way. So, you know. Go ham. Alright. <laughs> Once again, the ramping issue, not exactly a concern coming from the opponent. Uh, we just shave a counter spell. Alright. That was great. That was close. That was close. We had him. We had him. Right where we wanted him. But, uh, okay. Th this time it's for real, alright? Deck, very funny. So uh, let's let's do that again, but better. Oh man, I said better, but like I guess what did I expect when I have the mill deck? Uh, you know what? We're gonna mulligan. Okay, all right, sure. Yeah, you got me. This is always a tap land, so we're gonna play it. And their graveyard for the most part doesn't matter, and if it does, hopefully we draw Ashiok or Cling to Dust or something. Although I realize I cannot play this next turn. Nuts. This is bad. But I need my mana. Oh, dude, these crabs. Let's hope I draw a land. Untap blue land. Untap blue land. Untap blue land. Untap blue land. Here I go. Here we go. Okay. Nuts. All right. Um, I'm going to have to eat my own card in the grave. Or I hold up mana. I hold up mana. Let's hold up mana. We can essence scatter. Uh, that feels good. Yeah, light up the stage. You got it. Land, land. Yeah. It probably shouldn't let you have that. There we go. Okay, first off, rune crab. <laughs> the opponent's like, what? I was afraid of this the whole time? Why? You know what? We're also going to play another rune crab because who are we lying to here? <laughs> who are we lying to right now? Nobody. So I'm going I'm to go ahead and just get that dealt with. Sure. Blow up my crab, but know that I don't I don't like you for that. That's very rude. Blew up my my little adorable crab. Didn't even do anything. Uh-huh. Swole scar mage. You got it. Oh yes! Yes! Okay. Alright. Alright, we might be in a good spot, but I mean I'm not gonna say anything yet, because who knows. Uh, let's go ahead and eat up that that card, draw a card. Oh, nice. Land. Not, not what I wanted right now, but... Oh, but that is what I wanted right now, actually. Because I just drew a Scarab God. Boom! Hit him with the mill. No, stop. <laughs> opponent, you're killing me, man. You're actually killing me, opponent. I'm dying. All right. Here we go. The Scabby G's! The Great Beetle! I mean, that... I'm not gonna lie to you. Scarab God looks kind of creepy. <laughs> like, if I looked like that, I'd be very afraid. Scarab God is very terrifying. But also cool. Check it out. You like Mill? Me too. Me too, opponent. I love Milling. Who wants to be a millionaire? <laughs> Boom, taste it, right there. Oh yeah, here we go. Got the W, all right, cool. That's all we care about. Went to game three. Look at that, look at that, YouTube. Went to game three when I kinda, I mean, just like you, I kinda didn't believe we would make it this far, especially considering I forgot to remove a card from my side, from my main deck, but you know what, whatever. 61 cards is the new hotness. Um, yeah, yeah, okay, all right, pass. Yep, here you go. Here we go! Opponents laughing so hard, they're like, oh man. I just dropped a game to Mill. Although if this were modern, I think I think modern Mill won one of the 
big online events, which is a bummer because I was like, I thought I'd be like super slick sliding into the meta with my mill deck, but if everybody's re like, apparently Seth said that everybody's ready for it. So people are ready for the mill. That's not chill. No chill mill. Um, I'm going to have blow up whatever you play, right? On turn one, unless you don't play anything. Boom. Nice. Give him a heart. The heart hedron. The hedron of hearts. Okay. That needs to go away at some point, but not right now. We're not at that level yet where that needs to die. Maybe we are, but if they cast, like, light up the stage, I'm gonna counter that. Okay, I'm gonna counter that. Can't let him have that. What are they- <laughs> what are they holding on to? <laughs> I'm very afraid of what they're holding on to, so... <laughs> but I gotta get Bruvok on board at some point, right? It's also just a good body to have. Steam Crim is fine. Uh, block? I mean, if they blow this up, that's fine with me. Okay. Let's go ahead and get that out of here. No! Not whirls with squirrels! Alright, I need some lands or something to do. So let's go ahead and eat from their yard first. Boom! Nice. I mean, I, I kind of just got to keep blocking, right? For the time being. I, I can't just... I mean, I at least got to use Bruvok now. If they want to burn it out, that's fine. Unless it's another Chain Whirler, that's super value. Okay. Sure. Let's just keep eating cards from their yard. I, I mean, I need to find something to do, so... Oh, Rune Crab. One would say we're about to ruin their game plan. <laughs> Alright. I'm not gonna block. <laughs> the crab's here to stay. For the time being, the crab's here to stay. I guess at some point I do need to be ready to deal with what they're doing, but right now the crab is good. Alright, deck. Oh, I have to exile everything? Hmm... Nah, not worth it, right? Not worth it. Not worth it. Hey, oh, there you go. Mill two chain whirlers. I like the feel of that. Boom. Now we block chain whirls with squirrels for days. Um, feels pretty good, right? We're online. <laughs> Millitron. Not really. We do need a little bit more, but online nonetheless. Block. You want to spend removal on a Merfolk Secret Keeper? That's getting countered right now. No, thank you. Not today. Not today. Give him the heart again. Can, can we live long enough to actually mill the burn deck or the red deck? Yes! No! Get out of here with that nonsense. No, we just mill all their lands. They want that. It's exactly what they want. But languish. Uh, what can I mill from their yard? Let's mill the Embercleave. One, two, three, four. Well, actually, four, five. There we go. Come on, give me something good. Something good. All right, that's good. That's good. That's really good, actually. Oh, perfect. We're not just dead to an Embercleave. Well, would you look at what we drew? Hmm. Huh. I could bring this on board right now. I think I will. I think I will. Get on board. We're hoping that this is good enough to keep you, uh, like, to where they draw some, like, not-so-great cards right now. Light up the stage is good, unless you hit two mount or a mountain, and, and I guess, you know, Heartfire Emulator's not the worst. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm still gonna block. Alright, perfect. Now we mill six? Yeah! <laughs> yes! Keep the mill train going! Let's get him to use some of that burn. Uh, let's see. I can mill some again. Yeah, sure. Sacrifice a desert. That's eight cards, right? They're down to 12 now in the library? Oh, yeah. That's good. Oh, yeah. One fours for days. 1-4 on the floor. Let's go. 1-4 was also what I was expecting our record to be with this deck, but 
This looks like we're moving towards another win. Yes, and we got there. So we finished the video at a record of four and one. Um, I went ahead and played well, like a few more after, you know, and we, we lost uh, another one after that and then won another one. So you could even say that we went a total of five and, you know, five and three or so. So the deck is a lot greedier than, you know, what you would like most of the decks in the format. I mean, we, we are kind of like cutting a little bit of interaction. Our interaction is to hopefully Blood Chief's Thirst and or counter the threats, but as you saw, the deck was sweet. It got the mill. Uh, the, the game plan of Maddening Cacophony plus Bruvok the Grandiloquent was perfect, right? Like, like that stole so many games for us. Uh, I don't think we could have won otherwise. So, like, example, sometimes people play over 100 cards, and, you know, they're really ready to dunk on your existence. So, uh, thank you so much for watching another episode of Historic 101. Uh, let me know what you think about the formatting. Uh, I think now I'm trying to see if we can just, like, maybe aim for, like, 40-minute videos. So, even if that, that means trimming the matches, because sometimes there's matches where we just win, and it's super easy, you know, like, they get mana screwed or something like that. And then, of course, or, or we, or it happens to us. And I, I figured... Maybe we actually now start putting out videos that more so just have the most entertaining matches, but that could be three to four matches and cutting the video time down to 40 minutes. So let me know what you think about that down in the comments. Other than that, thank you so much for watching the content. As always, feel free to leave a like and a sub and hit the bell icon to be notified when a brand new video comes up. Other than that, your friendly neighborhood Asian Avenger signing out, and I'll see you at the next one. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, help us out by clicking that like button down below. And to keep up on all the latest and greatest, click that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell icon to get alerts whenever we have new videos. And if you want to, check out some of our other sweet videos here and here.